49, 50. Brent here with Bring Your Own Tools and on today's episode, if you wanna learn how we built this amazing home workout station out of black iron piping, keep on watching. Let us start it. 51, 52. At this point in time, there is a lot of people looking for home workout remedies, myself included, and I had this big old box of leftover black iron piping that I didn't know what to do with, so let's put it to use. Look at that, the beauty of YouTube magic right there. Now you have to build two of these in order to have the workout station that I'm putting together. Now each wall section is gonna need two wall flanges, three 90 degree elbows, two T's, one female coupling, three two inch pipes, two 12 inch pipes, two six inch pipes, one 36 inch pipe, and of course one 16 inch pipe. Now, if you don't have a plethora of black iron piping in your garage, don't worry about it because you can easily purchase this product on Amazon in a plenty of other different stores. I will leave links in the description box below on where to actually purchase it. I will also note, make sure you're tightening properly because this one's tight. This one is not, and there's a reason for that. So make sure that you're tightening this properly prior to installing. Also a bit of a disclaimer, I am using half inch pipe, but I would prefer to be using three quarter inch pipe. I did just have a ton of different half inch pipe laying around, which is why I'm using it. And it is sturdy, however, I'm 180 pounds and it holds up for me, but I don't know how it's gonna hold up long term. Hopefully for a while. Now the one priority when installing it is making sure you hit stud locations. Luckily for me in this position, I have approximately 26 inches between these two studs and therefore it's pretty much a perfect placement for pull-ups as well as tricep dips. Now keep in mind with these flanges, you're only able to approximately hit two out of the four hole placement locations for the fasteners. This is because the flange is too wide for each stud. You wanna make sure you have your two vertical fasteners located and fastened properly, and the other two's not gonna make a big difference. I'm also using a very strong two and a half inch long screw, which will give me plenty of support. Just keep that in mind and don't use drywall screws because those will break. Now one black iron pipe piece that you don't need but is a nice finishing touch is a cap for all your ends. Now with this system all I needed was four of them for the entire thing which just gave it a nice little touch. But guess what? After you have those attached and fully installed, you are done. Okay, yes, it's not the prettiest thing of all time, but guess what? I can do wider pull-ups, I can do narrower pull-ups, I can also do tricep dips as well as crunches. I can even use an athletic exercise band in order to accommodate some other chest workouts and other types of athletic feats along the way. And that's what I call one beautiful, sexy beast. Oh yeah. Thank you all so much for watching. Please like the video, please subscribe to this channel, and please check out one of my other videos. You just might like it. This channel is all about helping others learn how to build and create on a weekly basis. Till next time.